Yeah, so I, I, I've taught a couple of different classes, well, quite a few different classes. I think starting uh, when I first became a professor, I got a first-year chemistry class, which was absolutely terrifying <laughs> because you'd get it thrown into classes with 300 students, uh, about two-thirds of which were going into engineering disciplines that didn't like chemistry, so they didn't really want to be there. <laughs> and then you're, you had to uh, maintain their interest over the, uh, the period. And there'd be two a day for about six weeks during the term. I didn't teach the whole course, I taught part of the course. Okay. But that was quite an experience, not, not necessarily to be repeated, I don't think. <laughs> And then I, I took that class here, took, but yeah, I took that class. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Every first or every uh, first year uh, engineer tends to take that class. And then the other class I've taught are things like uh, specialist classes in hydrometallurgy. So those are just dealing with the chemical processing of minerals once again. So I've taught that at the third year level, the fourth year level, and the graduate student level. And then the other one that's really quite interesting was a, a course on metallurgical economics, which I'm still teaching to this day. And uh, when I first joined UBC and was working with Professor Peters, it was a class he taught for many years. And he said, Dave, if you want to make sure that uh, you get tenure and never get fired, teach this class because nobody else wants to teach it. So if you start to teach it, uh, nobody will want to uh, replace you because you'll have a job for life if you're willing to keep that class. And of course, that was a, a, was a joke at the time, but uh, it's become an invaluable class because it teaches you all about the, the uh, economic aspects of what you're doing in mineral treatment. Pretty, uh, which pretty important is in real life. <laughs> extremely important. Yeah, so we spend a lot of time actually talking about real life. We talk about all sorts of things related to uh, use of money in real life, you know, mortgages and pension plans mm -hmm. and annuities and all that sort of thing. But then we apply that to the mineral side as well and make sure that those personal finance issues are transferred into, uh, you know, what, what it means to run a company and how, how you make money as a company and all that sort of thing. So extremely valuable. And, and why uh, was it so uh, unpopular for the profs? I think because everybody likes to teach in their technical specialty. Okay. They prefer to do something like that rather than something that's more generic like that. Okay. And I don't think a lot of the other profs understand it as well as Ernie did, and Ernie transferred that knowledge to myself, and then I've, I've, I've thrived with it. I've loved that course ever since I started to teach it. Mm -hmm.